All right, good morning, globe hoppers. It's time for another McDonald's World Tour edition, and today we are in Antigua, Guatemala. And look at this place. This doesn't look anything like your typical McDonald's, does it? The architecture here in Antigua doesn't allow for any golden arches or anything like that. I mean, you could be walking past the Burger King, a McDonald's, Taco Bell, they all look the same. It's just traditional architecture here. So we're gonna head on in right now, check out the menu, and give you guys a treat today. So guys, this is breakfast, like I was saying. So let's check out the traditional first. Is that what you're having? Yep. You're gonna do We're this? We're gonna share that, yeah. Oh yeah, I ain't eating the whole thing. Yeah, we're gonna eat all of that. I want you scrambled. You want a round egg, a scrambled yeah. egg, or a scrambled egg with veggies? Scrambled. All right, we'll do scrambled. I was afraid she was gonna say veggies for a minute. All right, so we got one of those, yep. There's our grilled cheese that we love so much. I might just do, yeah. No extras, we said. Oh, this is my favorite. It's the sausage egg and cheese McMuffin. So I'm gonna do one of those. Add to order. And let's see. No thanks on the extras again. What's under recommendation? Recommendations for breakfast. Traditional breakfast. Oh, it's all the same got. thing. <laughs> Alright, let's see what else they got. Lunch for cafe. So this is the McCafe part. Yeah, this is where it gets funny. I don't know what that soup is. Are you brave? Bean soup. Bean soup? Mm. You know I don't like tomato soup, but do you want to try a bean soup or no? All right. All right, one bean soup. I don't soup. think I've ever done bean soup. Just eight ounces. Yeah, yeah. tiny <laughs> bean soup. <laughs> we'll add that to the order. And then... What else did they have under lunch cafe? I'm curious about the salads. Lunch cafe. I'm not gonna get one right now. Chicken uh, and Caesar. That chicken cod looks really good, but I'm not looking for that right now. All right, but the sandwiches. Let's check this out. We got a roast beast, a Louisiana, and a Caesar, and a Toscano. Which one do you want? I don't know which one to even try. Yet. I don't know. What is that? Um, I would say that's chicken, that's obviously beef. This that's looks like, like ham? Yeah. I don't know, and this one pork? That's like avocado on there, so I don't think you'll like that one. Maybe. Oh wait, maybe it's lettuce? I don't know. I can do a roast beef. Alright, let's yeah. try a roast beef since right. we've never seen it. Roast beef and mushrooms? Uh -oh. You like mushrooms. I like mushrooms. I'm gonna give her her mushrooms, guys. Oh, maybe give me a mushroom. White bread or whole wheat? White. Thank you. <laughs> I thought it was gonna go bad. All right, so we'll do that. Now we just need some sort of side. Where's the sides here? We did the Snacks. breakfast, right? Snacks. Oh my goodness, we got griddle cakes. What is a griddle cake? We're gonna find out. Yes, we are. We're gonna get to the order. We got a griddle cake. Oh, okay. Oh, we reset What did us. you, what's, um... I gotta get a hash brown. Yeah, get two. Or we'll share one at two, yeah. Right, we all share like hash, hash browns. browns. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, I want to check one more thing under that. There was a special thing. Snack thing. What is this? Oh, that's just the grilled cheese. But they have different kinds here, right? They have um, with tomato, tomato and bacon. Oh. Yeah, this is gonna be ridiculous, people. We were just saying this morning how we felt so skinny. We're doing good on this trip, and it's all over. All right, what else? I want to see... Just remember, we do this for you. <laughs> oh, look, there was way more. A Super Captain McMuffin. Oh, my God. <laughs> Holy shit. You want me to change mine and put that one on it? I think so. All That's right. with sausage. And, and those I'm, look like yeah. onions. Yeah, we're going to do it. <laughs> Ham or sausage? Sausage. sausage. Just the sandwich. Just the sandwich. One of course. Now we gotta just start. Uh, Make sure we take the other one off because yeah. we forgot on the last video. Right. I think this is quite enough, right? We've had enough. Yeah, food I just now. need a cup of coffee. Alright, you get your coffee. Let me see this. Alright guys, well she gets her coffee and takes that first sandwich off of there. I'm gonna show you what I found so special about this McDonald's right here. The architecture is amazing. There's no giant golden arches in this country outside. You got your McCafe over here, which I'll stop in in a second. 
but it's all outdoor dining. Check this out. There's your golden arches hidden in the backyard. What do you think guys? How is this one wild McDonald's? Look they got art on the wall and stuff. I'm coming. <laughs> I forgot you needed money. <laughs> I oh. have money, I was going to pay. Guys, I screwed this up. I walked away filming and forgot to give it a card to pay. <laughs> Swings inside the arches. Look at that. Arches down, arches down. Okay guys, so originally we weren't even gonna make a McDonald's video here in um, Guatemala. But when we got to Antigua and we saw the buildings from the outside and how unique all the architecture was, we started to consider it. But then we saw the menu and the menu wasn't really too different from, you know, San Salvador and Central America, other Central American countries. So we were like, ah, we're probably not gonna do it. Then we saw the breakfast menu, and then we came in and saw the inside of this McDonald's, and we said, all right, we got to show you guys this. This one is special. So even though the food might not be the most crazy variety, the building itself makes it worth checking this one out. Even just now, as we were standing up front, we heard people walking out going, wow, that was such a unique McDonald's, wasn't it? And it really is. And I love dining al fresco like this. This is awesome. Sitting outside. Oh, two trays. <laughs> Buenos días, bienvenidos. Hello. Hello. Acá está su orden. Gracias. ¿Alguien más quiere decir? Perfecto. Thank you. Oh, I feel so bad when we make them carry two trays for our little videos. <laughs> All right, but let's just see what we got here. All right, guys, well, here we go. What a feast we got here. I'm going to move these out of the way. Put my hash brown over here because we know what those are going to taste like. But what do you want to start with first? Let's pick one of these. This? The big breakfast? All right. So this big breakfast has some, looks like fried plantains, brown stuff, white stuff, eggs. <laughs> Beans, cheese, eggs, sausage, tortilla, and plantains, I believe. Mm, 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 looking good. Hold that for a second to turn this. Ooh. Smell like anything? No. <laughs> <laughs> it smells like goodness. Oh, and there's a sausage underneath there too, I see now. Alright, this is more like Alyssa's speed here. She likes this, so I'm gonna try the sausage and eggs real quick. Now your sausage and eggs. I don't like any of that. <laughs> I'm not a fried plantain type of guy. They're not offensive. It's like a banana with less flavor. Yeah. How's the beans tasting? Let's see what this is. Mmm. The beans are pretty flavorful. That smells so good. Okay. Well, she tastes the eggs. I'll give you guys a peek at this. These are the McGriddles. And Did we used to have them in the US? Yeah, I think so. Oh, wow. They're nice and thick. Soft and they're full of maple. Look on the inside, even. See that? I don't know if you can see that on the inside, but oh, they look so good. Mm. Alright, as far as pancakes go, that one's pretty good. 
The beans and cheese are great. Plantains, like I said, taste like bananas, but without the sweetness. The eggs and sausage, there's no flavor to that sausage whatsoever. No spice like in the US. And the tortilla is just a regular flour tortilla. Yeah, you know, it is what it is. Try your McGriddle. <laughs> they even got the little logo on there. <laughs> Oh my gosh, this is so good. <laughs> so good. This isn't even a breakfast food. This is a um, a sweet, a dessert. Yeah. Now we got the grilled cheese again. And this one has bacon on the inside, right? Yeah. I was hoping it was actual bacon and not like Canadian bacon or... It's actual bacon. Yeah. And it's like I said in El Salvador, you can't go wrong with a grilled cheese. And now you stick bacon in it, that's just next level. Right? Oh yeah guys, the bacon is just next level for sure. That just adds a whole new dimension. If anybody mm. in the U.S. is listening, bring this shit aboard. I could eat these all day. Mm. This is delicious. Right? You would think that this little thing is the worst thing on the menu, but my God, it's so good. Literally, it's so hard. Listen. But it's chewy. Once you take mm -hmm. a bite of it, it's fine. Mm. Oh, that's good. Dude. All right, we'll come back oh, to him. Breakfast, this one? Yep. It's still breakfast. It's a behemoth, it's huge. Oh yeah, this is that monster one that we were like, oh, let's just try it because we need more calories. What is in it? So we got sausage, egg, another layer of egg, beans, bacon, and it looks like a plantain in there. Holy crap, they just took everything in the kitchen, threw it on an English muffin and said, hey, let's name this. A super, super captain, what is All it? Alright, <laughs> I can feel my order is clogging, but let's just do it. <laughs> my God. I gotta get a photo of this. I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm not even sure where to begin with this one. Because, well, because it's just got so many different flavors. There's two types of cheeses, it seems like. Beans, plantain, sausage, bacon, eggs, and English muffin. Oh, that's definitely bizarre. But really, it actually tastes so good. They all mix so well together, right? I could do without the beans, obviously, because I'm not a bean person, but... Pretty good? I'm the opposite. I like the bean flavor, but I don't like the plantain on it. Yeah, that might be the texture I'm not liking, the plantain. It's Let's a throw that sweetness. Away. It's a sweetness that's added to it that doesn't need to be there. Wow, absolutely. Surprisingly good. Mm-hmm, not bad. All right, what else you got on your tray, anything? All right, now we have to move to the lunch side of the room here. And I've got that roast beef sandwich on whole grain, I don't know what kind of bread that is. Yeah, we said regular white. But that doesn't look like regular, right? Mm -hmm. It looks like multi-grain multi -grain. And then it's got a salad cheese and roast beef and, and it just make note of the salad it's like a whole real, salad, le real yeah. lettuce it's not just your iceberg lettuce that's like carrots everything yeah lettuce. all right let's try to make roast beef mm. well, I gotta move. cut you a bite Salad's definitely fresh. The bread's good. The texture of the meat's not bad. It's just uh, got a little mayo on it. It's really not bad. It's I don't think I would order it, but I'm confused about it. Hold on, let me. I think I need yeah. another bite to decide on yeah. this one. Let me try that one more time. don't eat roast beef so mm. to me it's kind of like 
could do without it. Yeah, I'm not a huge roast beef fan like this, but I mean, it's not bad. I wouldn't call this a bad sandwich. I think the street pups will probably enjoy it when we leave here, because do good on this. Okay, yeah. I'm enjoying the breakfast food a lot more than I thought I was going to. <laughs> So yeah, we're not gonna push it with the sandwich. I'll eat it in a few minutes. This so I'm next not really, thing. Yeah, let's try I'm the excited. bean soup. Well, here's the thing. I'm gonna good. pass this over to you so you can try this. And then we got oh, that's your coffee stuff. No spoons? Uh oh. Well, party foul. Yeah, it's too. But look, it comes with all of these types of tortillas, chips, and. It's I like a carrot. It's, carrot it's like a, um, a dried carrot. A dried plantain. Like freeze dried. Look at these. Mm. Maybe that's why they don't give you a spoon. You're supposed to eat it with a chip. Oh, maybe. Maybe that's the secret. Chips and guacamole. It's getting a little windy here, guys. Sorry about this. Everything's blowing away on us. All right, so what do you think? Oh, we gotta try the home fry too. Of course, can't do not try that. It's better just to drink it like this. I'm good. You're good. I'm not a bean soup fan. And of course, your hash browns are delicious. So. That is our crazy invention for this morning. Yeah. We're definitely going to try to eat some of this up. Let's just recap real fast. The grilled cheese with bacon, number one in the world. See? <laughs> Should have hit it until the end of the meal. <laughs> and the hash browns, you can't go wrong. The breakfast, she loved it. Everything in there was good to her. This sandwich with the uh, skyscraper sandwich here, this was just insane. Mm. I, I think they just went one or two ingredients too far with that. But hey, what can you do? The McGriddles. She Amazing. loves that for sure. The roast beef sandwich and the bean soup. We should have just skipped lunch and just made it breakfast today. That's all. The bean soup I enjoyed. I don't like the roast beef sandwich, but yeah. you don't like the bean soup. No. So overall, not bad, but interesting. And you can't beat this McDonald's just simply for the sheer I don't even know. Behind us. Can you even see that? That's a swing set back there. That's yeah. so cool. <laughs> I walked them back there. Oh, yeah. Okay. And showed them. Yeah. So yeah, come Very for the ambiance, come for the building, come for the atmosphere, come for breakfast. Nothing special here for lunch though guys, but if you stuck around to the end of this video, we appreciate it. Thanks for watching. More McDonald's to come in the future. See you soon. Mm, love it. Love it.